Hey, this is Lee Starro with UX in Motion, and here's a look at the storytelling with UI tutorials. Now, let me tell you a quick story. So a couple of years ago, I was hired by a company to work on a project, a really cool project. And I had all these really like amazing ideas that I knew were gonna have a ton of value for the project, but they just weren't sticking with the team and the stakeholders who happened to be the business owners of the company. And so I kept trying to re-explain my concept in all these different ways. And I had like, you know, these stills, these beautiful frames mocked up and I was gesturing a lot and explaining how cool it was and they just like didn't get it. And they were like, dude, no way, it's not gonna happen. It's not, not a good idea. So I was thinking, I was like, well, how can I create something that will just not, not have me explain what it is, but actually show them what I'm talking about? So I went out and I shot some video and I took the graphics I was, I was designing and I put them in the video. I tracked them, I composited them and I made this sort of like little narrative uh, video, ex like showing my concept, not explaining it, but showing my concept. And so I, I showed them the render and they were like, dude, why didn't you say so? That's brilliant, awesome, go ahead and do that. And it was like instant, total like buy off and they got it and it was amazing. And it was a great project. And it really got me thinking like, why did that work? Why was that so valuable? And how can I create something for you in your project so you can have that success? And I really had to take a step back and look at like, well, what's the real value here? And what I really really got and was the difference between explaining something versus showing something. And what this comes down to is actually being able to put your work in context and create a narrative around your work. And I know as designers, we're like always, you know, at the minutia of stuff, but if you step back, you'll really begin to see that whatever you're working on has a narrative. And there's a context that whatever solution you're creating came from a problem and you worked the problem and you got some information and you created solutions. Well, those solutions don't exist by themselves. There's always a context. And what we have is this amazing thing called video, which is the single most effective and brilliant way that you can actually put your work in context and show it to somebody and actually have them get it and have you not explain it, but they actually see it and they're like, oh yeah, that's amazing. So anyway, so I created these tutorials for you so you could do that with your projects. You just need your design files and you can like shoot some footage and I show you how to just track everything in and composite it, make it look absolutely gorgeous and stunning so you can show it and have people be blown away. So if that sounds good to you, I suggest you find the buy button on the page, you click that, put in your info, that'll take you over to PayPal, and then you can hit the pay button there and I'll send you an email with the links to download the uh, tutorials and the assets and they're yours for life and you can sync them to your phone or whatever you want and I will see you in the training. Hey, this is Isaro with UX in Motion and here's a look at the, we don't have a name for this. I know, I when I practice it, I'm like, oh, but then when I say it, I'm like, I just panic, you know? I said it. I didn't like say it well, but I said it. Hey, this is Isara with UX in Motion, and here's a look at the storytelling with UI training. I don't like the word training. So let me tell you about this real quick. So in my years, I don't know what I'm gonna say now. <laughs> don't, I got nothing. I got nothing. <laughs>